Like most holster wings, the mod wing attaches below the trigger guard portion of the holster. It's designed to work in conjunction with pressure from a belt or an Enigma in order to move the grip of the gun in closer to your body. The mod wing usually comes with two different size inserts. Generally, the larger insert will increase grip tuck into the body, while the smaller insert will produce less grip tuck. For most people, the small insert is just right, but sometimes the larger insert can be useful when the user needs more aggressive grip tuck. To switch out the insert sizes, simply unscrew the attachment, supporting the nut from behind, replace the attachment for your preferred size, and screw it back in. There are also angled inserts available on our website. These were designed to optimize the interface between the wing and our Enigma faceplate. The angle profile allows the wing insert to sit more flush with the faceplate and decrease offset. The mod wing usually comes assembled and configured for a right-handed user, but it is ambidextrous and can be switched for left-handed users with just a few adjustments. To switch the mod wing from right to left-handed, all you need to do to the mod wing itself is move the insert from one side of the mod wing to the other. For a more detailed explanation for switching your mod wing from right to left-handed, check out this video. Thanks for watching this video, and don't forget to check out all the additional resources we've made available on this YouTube channel, in addition to the resources available at filsterholsters.com.